Hi, in this video, we're going to be looking at Supernova SN2024GGI located in the galaxy NGC3621. This picture was taken by Damien Peach on April 16th, 2024. I'm starting the video with this picture because it's one of the best that I've seen so far. The supernova in this picture is the bright blue star in the very center of the picture, just to the left of the center of the galaxy. Zooming into the image, we can see the supernova more clearly. And we can compare its brightness to the star just straight above it there, which is listed as magnitude 11.5. So at this point in time, the supernova has a similar magnitude, probably around 11.5 or so. The supernova was discovered on April 11th, 2024, by a program called ATLAS. ATLAS is an acronym for the Asteroid Terrestrial Impact Last Alert System, which is a robotic astronomical survey and early warning system optimized for detecting smaller near-Earth objects a few weeks to days before they impact Earth. Just a few hours after the supernova was reported, Philip Romanov took this picture and the magnitude of the supernova was only about magnitude 16. This was taken on later on April 11th. When a star goes supernova, the star that exploded is called the progenitor. And in this case, the scientists that discovered the supernova were able to look at Hubble Space Telescope pictures that were taken several years beforehand of this exact part of the galaxy, and they were able to pinpoint the exact star that exploded, the progenitor of supernova 2024 GGI. We can find the progenitor in this Hubble archive image, which is available on the ESA Hubble website. It was uploaded on October 14th. 2013. And if we zoom in to where that red rectangle is, you will get this star field. And then if you once again zoom in to this red rectangle, you will get this image. The progenitor is the red star in the center of this image. Its coordinates match exactly the same coordinates as the reported supernova SN2024 GGI. This next photo is one that was taken by Duncan Milburn in Australia. And it, this was taken on April 11th into April 12th, 2024. This next picture was taken by Elliot Herman on April 12th. 2024. This picture was taken by Andy Casely on April 12th, 2024, from the Blue Mountains near Sydney in Australia. He estimated the magnitude of the supernova at 12.9. This image was taken by Bill Keel on April 13th, 2024. This picture was taken by Dylan O'Donnell on April 12th, 2024. Here's another image taken by Elliot Herman on April 13th, 2024. This picture was taken by John Stevenson on April 17th. At this point, the supernova is probably about maximum brightness at magnitude 12. And we'll end the video where we started with the image 
from Damien Peach. And I just want to give a few of my thoughts on this. For some reason, this supernova has not caught very much attention. We can compare it to a supernova that appeared last year, supernova SN 2023 IXF, which appeared in the galaxy known as M101. That supernova generated a lot of interest, probably because it was easily visible for viewers in the Northern Hemisphere, whereas this one is not so easily visible for Northern Hemisphere viewers. I don't know about all of you, but I'm looking forward to a supernova appearing in our own galaxy. And if and when that does occur, that will be big news. Um, it could appear possibly as brightly as magnitude negative 12 or so, which is about the brightness of the full moon. So if you imagine all of the light of the full moon concentrated into a single point in the sky, that would be quite something if we were to see something like that. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Give a thumbs up if you liked it and hit subscribe if you want to see more. Thanks.